What up, ladies and gents? It kind of looks like it could be my eyes. Just kidding. Okay, so I got the unique 3D Moodstruck Fiber Lash Kit. So I want to try it live so you can see whether or not I like it. I used it a long time ago, but I wasn't a huge fan then, so I'm hoping that we can change my mind. Okay, step one. Apply an even coat of transplanting gel to lashes. So here we go. Comes in a nice little bag. This is my very cash makeup look because I'm going out to dinner with my sister and her fiance, but and my husband, but I just don't want to get all dolled up today. Okay, transplanting gel, this one. So apply an even coat of transplanting gel. I didn't put liquid eyeliner on so we could actually see what happens to my lashes. I don't know if you can hear my stomach growling, but holy crap, I can. I'll do one eye at a time. Immediately, oh geez, immediately. Let's go, let's go. Immediately apply 3D fibers while transplanting gel is wet. Seal the 3D lashes with the transplanting gel until you've reached desired fullness. Oh my god, my stomach is literally growling. I was like, no. So when I used this years ago, I remember that I would do that. Step one, step two, and then step one again. And then I would be nuts. And I'd go over it again with the 3D lash stuff to make it fuller. It definitely makes them super long. The only other complaint I had about them last time was that the stuff would fall throughout the day on my face, so. I don't know guys, those things are intense. So I definitely don't know if there's anything else I've ever tried on the market that will give you that much length. Look at my other eye, one compared to the other. So I guess it does work. My only concern will be whether or not I feel like the 3D, like the little fibers end up falling on my face. So maybe you shouldn't double down like I did, but I like to break the rules, so. All right, so I'm gonna do the other eye. 
This is the step one, the gel. And then the fibers. and then the gel. So again, they definitely make my eyelashes insanely long. And just wish there was a way to make them thicker looking without being clumpy. Which I'm sure with practice I'll figure it out, but. So then they do like that like weird thing. I might go for another coat of this stuff. I just like a lot of thickness and I can't uh, get it to look that way. But anyone who's looking for length, these, this mascara gives you insane length. But I will test it out for everyone and see what it does by the end of the day, because I used to, I remember it would like crumble and fall all down here, so. I will let you guys know, because it is 30 bucks, so. It's not the cheapest stuff around. But I will give you my honest opinion as the night goes on. All right, bye guys. They do look kind of good though. I don't know how to, oh yeah. <laughs> Wink, <laughs> not raise your eyebrows. Sarah's like, bye.